In this guide for the best starting base locations in Ark Survival Ascended, the island map, I'm going to show you the top five best places to start your Ark Survival Ascended adventures. I'll give you map and GPS coordinates for all of the safest, easiest places to start on the island, and I'll show you where to get things like metal, silica pearls, organic polymer right next to these base locations. Some have no predators, are loaded with metal, and have pre-built structures where you can just move right in, and I'll show you where to find explorer notes right next to some of these so you can get a massive boost to your experience right off the bat. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and let's get started. So this is probably the best starting base location in all of Ark Survival Ascended on the island map. We are here on this little peninsula, and let me show you the map coordinates. It's 94-2-52-5, and we're on the southern side of this lagoon. Now, if you spawn in South Zone 2, it's going to spawn you somewhere around this lagoon, and probably right around here. And this area is one of the safest areas on the entire island especially further to the eastern side and all along the coast here. There's tons of good resources, but one of the best things about this base location is right here, there's an explorer note. So if you spawn here, grab the explorer note, you can get massively boosted experience and run all along here getting all your gathering stuff. And then, if you go right here, there's a cave, and inside the cave is a pre-built structure. Basically gives you an entire house. All you've got to do is put down three foundations there, two foundations here, and you've got an entire house ready to go. You've got water right in your backyard, lots of space to put your tames in a pretty safe area, and these mountains block anything nasty from attacking you. And then if we go further to the east towards the ocean, you'll see this stream right here running back from the ocean. And the location here is 94.9.58.5. And this is also an amazing place for a base because you can build all over here. It's pretty, uh, pretty shallow very shallow water, it's very flat. You can have a swimming pool in the middle of your living room if you build it right, and there's natural walls all the way around. Not too many dinos can fit through here, but uh, your starting dinos should have no trouble getting inside, and then you've got a totally protected area. Now as we move further to the north of that spot, right next door is beavers. Tons of beavers spawn right here. You can get beaver dams and all of the silica pearls, tons of free wood and lots of cementing paste and then Hesperornis also spawn all over the place and you can club these for organic polymer. So the resources nearby are incredible and you're gonna get tons of easy tames for really good beavers. You can get all the wood you need right there and then if we go further to the west side you've got this river right here and Right along the river are cattails, which if they're the same as an original arc, you can get plant species X seeds from those using something like a trike and get all of the organic uh, vegan warfare you need for plant species X turrets. And then this mountain right here usually has beehives so you can get honey. And uh, let me show you the coordinates of this river right here, 87.6, 47.4. And then if we go up this slope just a little bit, we are on Metal Mountain, and there's already metal nodes right here, right over here, right next to the coast. Metal nodes look silver in Ark Survival Ascended, and this area is somewhat dangerous. This whole mountain is covered in metal, so it's got things like raptors, carnos, alpha raptors, alpha carnos, and then at the very top, we've got tons of crystal, too. So basically, everything you need to get started and have a pretty good mid-game in Ark is right at your doorstep with this base. And then right over here is the jungle cave, so you can get tons of good resources in there, too. This whole area is a flat plateau with just a a couple entrances to block off so as you progress in your game and need more space you can move up to some of these jungle plateaus and over here 
is another great flat plateau, which is huge. So your possibilities are endless. There's tons of easy ways to expand from this starting spot, but I would highly recommend this as the first place to start. Oh, and another really nice thing I should mention is right over here, if we go up this path and follow along this edge, there's actually a second explorer note. So once that one wears off, you've got another one right here that you can open up just inside the jungle, 882516, and keep that experience boost rolling for a long time. This is Herbivore Island, also one of the absolute best base locations in Ark Survival Ascended on the island map. And the first thing you'll notice here is there are no carnivores at all. Nothing will attack you unless you go in the water, attack one of them, or grab an egg off the beach, which a lot of people die to. So this is an amazing place to tame some really good herbivores, get yourself started, and get yourself leveled up to level 38 where you can tame a pteranodon and go explore the whole arc. There is metal all over here. The entire upper section is covered in metal nodes all around the rim, and you can get all the metal you need, and there's also ankylosaurs all around the island, especially in the back, and you can tame Ankies really easily and start smashing the metal even at level one because you can park one next to a metal node even without a saddle and it's going to go ahead and smash those for you. There's also an explorer note right here on top of the rim at 90.89.9 and you can use that for a huge experience boost, especially if you're crafting metal up here. So this is a really awesome place to get started and you can go a long ways. The only trouble is it's a very remote location. So we're very far away from the rest of the map, and even though you can get tons of metal here really easily, a lot of the other resources you need are going to be a lot harder to find. And uh, another tr problem with this area is you've got to get here first. Now, if you spawn in South Zone 3, it's going to put you somewhere along this coast, and that's great, but you do have to make it across the ocean. Now this area is relatively safe. It's a lot safer than a lot of areas and you can get yourself to a, a high enough level to get a bed built and put it down on this little island and then try swimming across and respawn if you die, especially if you lure the sharks away from this area, maybe to the side, and then try making this swim. You just have to make it across this bit of open water and then you can make it pretty safely across these islands. Or you can start basically any Anywhere, get yourself to level 16 and sail a raft all the way over to Herbivore Island, as long as you don't get sunk by whales, which there may be some lurking in the deeps. So we are here at another one of the best starting base locations on Ark Survival Ascended, and it's a really cool plateau that's surrounded on almost all sides by sheer cliffs, which are going to keep your tames really safe, and it's almost completely flat, one of the flattest building areas around, so it's a great, ideal place to start your base. You can put one wall across this spot right here, and the entire section is all yours to build in. Now, we're right here at uh, 84, 8, 24, 4. And if you spawn in South Zone 1, you may show up somewhere along this coast and you can run here in a relatively safe beach area to get here. There's also an explorer note right in the center of this plateau, right here. But the downside to this base location is you have to go a long way to get a lot of resources like metal, uh, beaver dams, silica pearls, things like that. There used to be silica pearls in the water right off of this shelf, but as far as I can find, I don't see any of them right now. It may just be the water's too murky, but... I haven't been able to find any of the pearls that used to be here on Ark Survival Evolved. But this is still a really great base location, especially if you want to build a huge structure and have a flat area to work with where it's going to be up high from predators. Now this is another of the best starting base locations in Ark Survival Ascended. We're here on this long peninsula beach. It's actually pink sand on this beach, and there's really nothing dangerous that spawns on this entire very flat area of beach. You uh, run into some pegos and seagulls, some occasional dilos, but that's the worst you're going to run into over here, unless something runs across the water. So it's a great place to get a good start. There's tons of resources all over the place. 
And if you go a little bit to the north, there's even a cool spot where you could build a house with a swimming pool built into it. The problem is you have to spawn in West Zone 3 to get here, and that's going to put you along the West Beach anywhere from here to almost the Arctic. But even if you die and respawn, you might end up closer to this spot, and if you keep following the beach to the south, you'll eventually get here. But one of the best things about this base location is there are some incredible resources really close by. So if we go just a bit to the north to where this tree has the rocks kind of hugging it and go out to the edge of these rocks right here and then head straight down to the bottom of the ocean, there's a cave which has some of the best drops in it in the entire map. And if you tame a frog and go down there and just run from all the sharks and mosasaurs, you can get some amazing loot and just farm that all the time if you live nearby. And if you sail just a few minutes further north on a raft, you can get to what a lot of people call Party Beach or uh, the Mosh Pit, which is where the Arctic meets the tropical area. And that is loaded with amazing tames like Dodicarus and Kylosaurus. And you can pick up Rexes, Argies, things like that pretty easily on a raft and then take them back to your base to tame. There's one of the most concentrated crystal deposits right on the edge of the coast, and you can pick up silica pearls in a few feet of water if you can find them in the murky water without freezing to death. And then just a little further north, you can find tons of obsidian and oil rocks and lots of metal deposits too. So there are tons of really good resources, just a few minutes raft ride just to the north of that location. Now this is probably the most common starting zone in Ark Survival Ascended. Most people get their starting base here because it's South Zone 1. It's the default. If you don't know where you're going to spawn and you haven't watched a guide on it, you're probably just going to pick this one because it's the first one that shows up and you don't know what to do. Now, of all the starting locations, and we're at 84... 36 2. Of all the starting base locations, this is probably the one I would recommend the least. Even though it's got a pretty good setup, you got a lot of easy resources, and there's not going to be as many really bad nasty dinos here for a little while, you're eventually going to have raptors run down from that side across the ocean. You're going to have a bunch of nasty spinos show up from over here. And usually they'll eventually get to your base and wipe it after a while. So I'd highly recommend if you start here, you move away and get a better base as soon as you can. Now there are a couple good spots. If you want a nice little beach hut, you can build it up off the ground over here out of Raptor's reach. And uh, this little plateau up here actually lets you get up there if you, uh, you know, build some ladders and ramps and all that stuff. And you may even be able to get tames to where they're safe up there from things like spinos. And you We've also got a couple little cliffs back here, which can uh, let you build relatively safely up on the cliffs, but you do have some nasty stuff that comes in from the jungle, like carnos and things like that. And there are beavers up here, right at the mouth of this river, so you'll find beaver dams pretty close by. There's Hesperornis around, so it's got some decent things going for it, but there's an even bigger problem. And by big, I mean massive. This is a Titanosaurus, and they can spawn in this area. They're pretty rare to get this far away from the Redwoods, but they can show up and wipe your entire base. So I won't ever recommend building a main base near a Titano or Giga spawn because those things can completely wipe you out in no time at all. So I'd recommend if you do start here, if you make this your starting base location, I would move away relatively soon so you don't get wiped by something really big and nasty. So hopefully one of these top five starting base locations on the Ark Survival Ascended Island map will help you get an easy, fun start to your Ark Survival Ascended adventures. Drop a comment and let us know if you end up moving into any of these locations or if you choose some other base locations, and I'd love to hear how your adventures are going. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if it helped you so other people can be helped by it too. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and ring that bell for all notifications, otherwise you'll probably miss our next really helpful Ark Survival Ascended guides. There are so many more helpful guides, tips, and tricks coming out for all the best base locations, best resource locations, and strategies for Ark Survival Ascended, and you're not going to want to miss those. So, we'll see you in the next video. 
Thanks for watching this video from the Ark Survival Guide. Please give it a thumbs up, share it around, and leave a comment. That helps us so much, and we love hearing from you. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and ring that bell for all notifications so you don't miss our next video full of tricks that will help you win at Ark. While you wait, here's more videos you can watch right now, and we will see you in the next video.